For the first time in a heartbreaking interview, the mother of a Kenosha baby killed by her own father opens up about the tragic loss. Little Serenity Rose, who would have just turned one years old, only on 12 News tonight, her mom shares memories and home video of her little girl with our Christina Palladino and wonders how something so horrible could have cut her life so short. Oh, baby. With beautiful eyes, a lot of hair, and a larger than life personality, yeah, Serenity oh, Rose baby. just lit up a room. Sometimes it's, it's really hard to look at her pictures, um, but in a way, they also help me because I, that's the only thing I have now. Most days for April Lampy are painful, but she's trying to be strong to honor her daughter's memory. I know she wouldn't want me to be sad all the time, so. Serenity would have celebrated her first birthday yesterday, but she was violently killed last month. Her father, Russell Rose, has been charged in her death. He's also accused of trying to kill April after an argument. I wish that I would have seen signs or something to indicate that, you know, this was going to happen, but I didn't see anything. April says she tried everything to save Serenity. But like I said, I was very protective of her, and I feel like I was protecting her from the wrong thing. <laughs> but I didn't know that that's what I should have been protecting her from. April feels peace being at Serenity's gravesite and looking through the few baby items she was able to save after Rose set their apartment on fire. These are the only memories she has left. To know that I don't get to hold her and kiss her and tell her how much I love her. It took a lot of strength for April to talk with me this evening, but she wanted to do this for Serenity. She was so looking forward to Serenity's first Christmas. She says her daughter loved to rip up all the wrapping paper. Now, since April lost everything in that fire, there are several community fundraisers for her, and we have all that information on our website, WISN.com. Absolutely heartbreaking. All right, so thank you. Well